it's like a hundred feet in proportion to this. Yeah. That's probably like a hundred, over a hundred feet. Yeah, it's pumping. You should be. Yeah. You got that whole thing pumping. Yeah. Well, you started from scratch with it. Yeah, I started from scratch. This thing was a fucking pain yeah. in the ass. Yeah. <laughs> Still is, huh? Pump. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hell of a way to water your lawn. distance to go as they're creating steam, they'll lose water in the boiler. And this is an auxiliary tank that this little pump on the side will take water from this tank through this little valve, this little pump on the side, through this hose here, and it'll pump it into the boiler. Because once you, once you have pressure in here, you can't unscrew the top and pour more water. In. Right. You got to pump water in. Mm -hmm. So that's how that works. That's just a tank that. Uh, and how much water gets consumed during an actual process or scale or whatever? You mean for boiling? Yeah. It boils a tremendous amount of water. But how much is lost in driving the steam? In? I'm not sure. See what happens though is they don't rely on this little tank to fill this all the time. This is only when the engine is in transport. Mm -hmm. And then once they hook it up to a source of water like this pail, yeah. then you you have this valve that you close, and it will take water from the pump okay. and pump it into the boiler. Okay, so it's bleeding some of the water feed that you're putting the fire out with down yeah. the boiler. back into the okay. boiler. Like I think I started like right here. And then I started going this way. And then, then I tapped the first hole. And then I kept moving around. I thought, well, all right, let's keep going. I kept tapping, tapping, and cutting, and tapping, and working. And 
And I came over here and I thought, well, let's just keep going. So I worked my way all around. Well, this looks like the heart side. Yeah, this was a pill. But once I got, once I got confidence in how it was working, then it, it just was easy to do. But you've got to use that sticky stuff, that super 77 glue, and just kind of spray a little bit on, and it, it holds it down, and you keep moving. That's how I did it. Well, this is the fine, final, the end of the end. The, the very tedious assembly would try not to scratch anything, bend anything, or put anything in the wrong spot. Oh well, we'll keep at it. this thing was too close to tolerance. Okay. Well, my fears are over. What's your fear? That it wouldn't run. I didn't have it. I didn't put the parts together right. See, this eccentric is very critical. This thing. And I couldn't remember which... Which one? Th this part here. This part... And this part, did it, does it, did it flip over this way or flip over this way? And, I, and that was the real confusing thing, but it's okay. I, I got it right, so it's good. good. So, so now you're happy again? Yeah.